Now then, the countdown to the Olympics well and truly on. But while much of the focus for London 2012 will be on our medal prospects, organisers are also really keen to inspire the next generation. And work to do just that is already well underway. So here with her third special report, Olympian Helen Barnes. Today, the Olympics is coming into school. Canoeist Fiona Penny is here to tell these Lady Bay kids all about canoe slalom. We're on our way into the hall now to see Fiona. The kids get so excited about assemblies like this, and I know that as a teacher because they just don't stop talking about it. Nottingham is home to many top paddlers. Fiona is five times British champion. Already an Olympian, she is one of Britain's strongest hopes for a medal in 2012. We need that support from the home nation behind us for the Olympics, so it's great that the, the kids get excited by it and then involved, and obviously in the end of the day, if they can take part and be the future champions, and that's great to see. She's joined by the team coaches who have brought in some canoes. Possible Olympian in the making now, I reckon. It's fantastic for the children to have Olympic athletes in school because it shows them that if they work hard, they stick at it, they can achieve. Now, time for the fun bit. Fiona is on hand to offer advice. So turn it around. That's it. Although it seems at least one is already quite an expert. Well, this lesson's coming to an end now. This is my sport and I absolutely love it. But for these guys, it's their first time. What did you think of it, Shyla? Well, I thought it was absolutely brilliant. I've never done it before and it's like really cool. They were so excited to have us come into school and talk about uh, the Olympics in general and you know, my experiences at the Olympics and then to come here to the swimming pool and for them to have a shot at it. And some of them have done it before and some of them have, are in their boat for the first time, so it's great for them. This is exactly what the Olympic legacy is all about, giving children like these an opportunity to try a sport that perhaps they wouldn't have chance to normally. It's just brilliant seeing them having such a good time. This is Helen Barnes for East Midlands Today in Nottingham. <laughs> Love the bit of dodgems there. Can I just say back to our main story in Chris Powell's departure? If he does go, he'll be sorely missed round here. He is a very fine man indeed, and everyone will be wishing him well. He's really loved at Leicester. They've